I managed to hit upon a premise. It was a premise that allowed the book to be described in a sound bite. It became the Freud murder thriller. I knew about a real life mystery that uh, surrounds Sigmund Freud's one and only visit to the United States. He came here in 1909. By all objective measures, he had a tremendously successful visit here, and yet he spoke of his trip to America as if it had scarred him in some way, and no one knows why. The interpretation of murder fills up that imaginary space. New York City in 1909 is a place of fantastic change. Skyscrapers are being built. Motor cars are replacing horses. And into this city walks Sigmund Freud. But the very next day, he gets drawn in to a murder case, which becomes quickly a psychoanalytic case. And the reason why is because the second victim doesn't die. She survives the attack but she's lost her memory. And it turns out she's suffering from a kind of hysteria, the kind of hysteria that Freud is the first to diagnose and treat with psychotherapy. The hero of the book is Dr. Stratum Younger, who is one of the first Americans who sees some of the importance, some of the great importance in Freud's ideas. The book traces the uh, simultaneous investigation by the police of the murder on the one hand and the psychoanalysis of the victim, Nora on the other, until these two methods of investigation converged. About 90% of the dialogue that Freud and Jung speak is taken from actual books, essays, letters that they wrote. I dug through thousands of newspaper articles from the time period and lots of books so that I would make New York City of 1909 as real as I could possibly make it. Two of the most important scenes in the interpretation of murder take place here. Not what you're looking at, which is the solid tower, but below that, a hundred feet below it, where they sank the foundations for this great tower. They had to build what they called then a caisson, which was like a great big diving bell, the size of a building, where they would do the dynamiting and the excavating. Then, when the men came up out of that bridge, they uh, began to suffer from terrible illnesses, which killed many of them crippled many others. What you're looking at behind me in a way is like the, the foundation of modern American life as we would come to know it. High society changed from a uh, quiet aristocratic crowd to the uh, fusion of scandal and power and money that it is today. And into this city walks Sigmund Freud with his own scandalous ideas about sexuality, ideas that would change America and influence it. And so this mixture of America changing its face and the new ideas that would uh, change modern American society. This is what I was trying to capture, at least in part, in the interpretation of murder.